All right, so I had a crash and lost a uh, certain video. So I'm just going to redo, um, or re-highlight rather, some of the things that we found that are obvious three fests in this last section here. I have no idea what I'd gotten up to, so I'm just going to review it all. <laughs> Didn't you love hearing that? Um, all these all these things that are violet knit together to make multiples of three. Black piano, that was an obvious. Holy Ghost one. Black clarinet, black coal. Gray brain, that was too obvious. And uh, I had solved this earlier, but we had a crash, and so I had been redoing this. Very obvious. Gray brain, gray spinner dolphin, gray elephant. Um, this was an obvious word. Commit to equals love plus love. Love has another one. Um, this was awesome, the gray harpy eagle. That thing is rad. Such a rad looking bird. And then same with this one. But this guy was exceptional. Um, and then we got the parallelism between pink pigs and green grass. Both the exact same for the number three. The exact same structure between pink pigs and green grass. Exact same, identical. Pink flower, pink carnation we solved. Um, Cotton candy, knit it together with these. Pink flamingo, we solved. That's the Bill Wilson number. Um, pink jellyfish, that was fun. And pink man of war three. Pink prince, pink bubble gum, that was an obvious one for for pink. Um, pink lip. Now we went into white land, and the things were just obvious. A white snowflake, a white rabbit, divides by three. This was obvious. A white whale. Look at how obvious the pair of white. The word white was to go together with whale. The T and the E made 21. The I and the L made 21. The rest of the letters are identical. So obvious. White whale meant to knit together. And then beluga divides by three. So white beluga whale is triple love perfectly. So awesome. Uh, white cream parallels white cloud. Exactly. Both divide by 15. And similar letters. And, you know, offsets. And then uh, a white dove. That's an obvious one for the Holy Ghost. Three, three, three. And then, amazingly, a white egret equals a white cloud. White flower, that's one of my favorites. I'm going to add some highlighting to that. 24 points higher. White iceberg. <laughs> Hello. 333333. Three, 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 three. Um, and we can put the Titanic together with the iceberg. Very nice. Um, so what else is white? We were in white land before we had the crash. I'm just pulling things off this uh, gem here. So white is um, plus two. You're looking for white ones. A white igloo is an obvious combo. Oh my goodness, that equals one, two, three. Good night. Good night. Um, and uh, what else do we want to do here? A white polar bear. That was an obvious gem. Yaka yaka. Three. Um, Now I'm curious as to like ones that have different offsets, like the law of prime regarding white milk. Yeah, that's easy. Ooh, a snow goose, a swan. Excuse me. Yeah. A white snowy owl. Well, let's solve the snowy owl. Yeah, it hits the 15th prime. <laughs> White rice. That's, yeah, easy. 100 bang on the nose. And very parallel to word white with word rice because this, all these letters knit together and then you got an E on the end. Very parallel with threes. Very cool. Alrighty. Uh, that's easy. Mm. <laughs> Not bad. All right. What color should we dig into next? Mm. 
There's so many things that are brown. It's not even funny. That'll take you a good while. All right, let's take a break. <laughs>